Welcome to Noord-Holland, the province with the capital of the Netherlands, Amsterdam, Europe's largest airport, Schiphol, and the highest volume of traffic in the Netherlands. So in order to develop uh, autonomous vehicles, you have to try and you have to um, experiment in the real world. This is one of the big, big problems about uh, creating and developing autonomous vehicle technology. Uh, without testing on real roads in real environments, it's very difficult to create uh, safe and, and reliable systems. Um, together with the province, we are able to do this. The province of North Holland is uh, an innovative organization and they are very much cherishing and embracing new technology uh, to help make traffic smoother and safer and provide uh, transport services. Noord Holland has almost 3 million inhabitants. In the province there is a road network of more than 13,000 kilometers of roads, which every day more than 1 million private cars and nearly 300,000 company vehicles make use of. We regulate this traffic with 270 traffic lights and 30 dynamic route information panels. We monitor the traffic situation from our own modern traffic control center with 180 cameras. We are the only province in the Netherlands that has its own traffic control center from which we control the traffic and collect real-time data. We share the data with market participants and we use this to make our infrastructure smarter. The goal of the pilot future bus was to figure out how the technology is working. The province helped us with a contact to the traffic light uh, producer and they helped us with uh, full communication with the traffic light and so we could do the traffic light communication via Wi-Fi P. Together we worked on developing uh, machine learning algorithms in order to predict the red light and green light duration of the traffic lights. Um, so we applied machine learning techniques and together we developed this, uh, these algorithms and then we could give these algorithms to the autonomous vehicle system so that the, the vehicle system could now ask the, the traffic light for green light extension or um, could reroute itself in order, dependent on uh, when the traffic light would change. And this is a very unique capability uh, that I think is, is one of the first ones in the world that we have demonstrated this capability together. In 2017, we installed 48 intelligent traffic lights. With these intelligent traffic lights, we can collect and use even more real-time data. The intelligent traffic lights offer different communication capabilities. It's so interesting to have it in real-life situation running in full throttle and to see what are the problems, what are the chances of this new technology. Um, this is one of the best places in the world to do this, uh, this type of work. The infrastructure around Schiphol is arranged in order to run tests including traffic signal priority for designated vehicles and green light optimal speed advisory. And there's a map available of each intersection. We invite market participants to examine with us what smart mobility means for our infrastructure and how we can ensure a smooth flow and increase traffic safety. At first sight, it may seem unexpected to work with a province and a car manufacturer together. But uh, experience in the past has shown that this is a very good combination. To other uh, OEMs, I would say, um, you know, the province of North Holland is one of the, the few that are willing to collaborate, have the data, um, and have the capability of trying something that goes from an idea to actually doing something in practice, and, and that is a unique capability. You are welcome to do pilots in Nord Holland.